comfortable as it is. Halt! Only the citizens of the town and the king's troops can get into the upper end of the town. I'm a respected citizen of Corinus. Let me pass. Whatever prompted the masters of Corinus to let you sign on as an apprentice, I don't want to know about it. You may enter, but behave yourself. Otherwise, you'll have the worst trouble in your life. Ah, you again! So, you actually managed to get into the upper quarter. There are some things you must heed here. Otherwise, you will wind up outside as fast as you got in here. You're only allowed to enter the merchant's buildings. You can recognize them by the signs over the door. Just so there are no misunderstandings. The other buildings belong to important citizens. There is nothing there for you. The important citizens of this town live in this quarter. So treat them with respect. Do we understand each other? Just sure. Said. <laughs> That'll never change. Do you know anything about a stone creature from the stone circle at Lobar's farm? Certainly, we destroyed it. It was a threat to the surrounding farms. I don't know why, why do you ask? Uh, he really do you think that's normal? That stone monster, you mean? As far as I know, the water majors are taking care of it. I don't give it much thought. We have our tasks here in town and in the Valley of Mines. I see. I'm looking for metal fragment of a ring ornament. It should have been somewhere near Lobart's stone circle. Yes, there was such a thing. The stone creature was carrying it. I thought it was a rune of magic. I gave it to Lord Hagen. I have no idea whether he's still got it. Where can I find Lord Hagen? He's in the town hall, at the end of the upper quarter. But you will not be admitted there without a good reason. He really should have known better. Has anything exciting happened lately? Yes, that they let someone like you in here. Such a thing hasn't happened in ages. That was quite obvious. You can't rely on that. See? That wasn't so hard. We can only wait and see. No one really wants to hear that. I already thought as much. It's no secret. Get out of here! Yeah, get out! Smart kid.
and Beliar spoke to another creature. But Adonis brought forth no the tide, like and that. the creature was washed from the face of the earth. He really didn't deserve that. I've got no time for things like that. Hey, you! My name is Lutero. I buy and sell all kinds of things. What wares do you have to offer? Well, especially rare and unusual things. So far, I've always managed to fulfill my customers' wishes. Show me your wares. Welcome, traveler. Looking for a fine potion? I have a large selection and reasonable prices, and my potions are much better than the stuff that Zurus sells. Show me your wares. You have no business being... Hey, you're not quite as stupid as you look. I've got no time for things like that. Never get this open without the right key. Hey, you're not quite as stupid as you look. He really should have known better. You have no business being here. Get out of here. You have no business. Hey, yeah, you're get not away from quite here. as stupid as you look. Wait a minute. What are you doing here? I make sure that nobody enters the houses. Explicit order from Lord Hagen, and don't even think about violating this order. I couldn't feel that. How are things? At the moment, everything is quiet. Nobody ever asked for my opinion. Same so old thing all over again. You have to believe everything you hear. I used to say that once. Get out of my bed!
I'll never get this open without the right key. What do you want here? Go! Smart kid. What do you want here? Go! Yeah, See, get out! That wasn't so hard.
What do you want, smart kid? Get away from here! wasn't so hard. Hey, you're not quite as stupid as you look. A few lockpicks would be helpful. Get out of here! Yeah, get out of here! You're not quite as stupid as you look.
Uh, damn it. What do you want? Can you sell me some lock picks? If I have any left. Yeah, get away from here. Yeah, get out of here.
I'll never get this open without the right key. What are you doing here? What are you accosting me for? Who are you anyway? I, uh... Say, don't I know you from somewhere? Not that I remember. That's funny. I could have sworn I'd met you before. Never mind. You're all obviously gutter scum anyway. You all look alike somehow. Maybe so. Don't get snotty. Who do you think you're talking to anyway? The least you can do is address me in a more appropriate tone. And now get out of my sight! How's it going? Have I not made it clear that I want no contact with you? No, not in so many words. So I certainly hope you get the point now. What do you want here? Get out of here! Get out of here! Yeah, Smart get kid. out! <sighs> Damn it! What's up? So you're one of us. Then I got some useful information for you. Some of the houses up here have secret panels that can only be opened by hidden switches. People hide their valuables behind them. What are you doing here? What do you think, huh? I'm a gardener. I take care of the garden. You're pretty much by yourself here, aren't you? Yes, and it should stay that way. I'm glad that I have some peace here. Once, they wanted to send me to the penal colony because I did some guy in. 
But Larius, the governor, needed another gardener, and so I could stay here. Over time, this garden has become my home, and I'm content with that. Are you growing herbs as well? A few. I'm growing fireweed and fire nettles. I also tried swamp weed, but that doesn't really thrive here. Well, I just harvested. So if you want to buy something. Show me your wares. Wait a minute. I am Geryon, master of two-handed combat and paladin of the king. Why are you disturbing me? Can you train me? If you wish to learn something, you must turn to a teacher from outside of our order. I am a warrior, not a teacher. Creeping around there for. Now that's too much. He simply talks too much. You don't say. So you did it. Now you know who my employers are. Stick to what Cassia tells you. We don't care who you are otherwise. You're one of us, and that's all that counts. Ah, you're involved with the gang. All right. In that case, I've got something for you. If you ever need some lockpicks, come to me. I still have a few around. Just ask me for something to drink. Give me something to drink. Just come to buy fish. I'll make you an offer. If you have any silver plates or chalices, I'll take them for a good price. That's totally obvious. For all your stuff, I'll give you 450 gold pieces. It can't go all right, sold. We've made some good deals today. Better not come back until tomorrow, or somebody might get suspicious. You I've got see? My own opinion about that. Anything's possible. I'm in enough trouble as it is. Hey. 
about those missing people. Teach me something. You should have seen it with my own eyes. It's not what I heard. You've already gotten more dexterous. Good. Your strength has increased. Go, I haven't heard Don't tell me that. Tell me more about Lee and his mercenaries. What do you want to know? These are bad times. Why aren't you with Lee and his mercenaries? But I am, just not on the farm. You could say I'm our outpost in the city. We don't want the ship to sail without us. What ship were you talking about? It's on the open sea harbor, behind the cliffs. Lee and a few of his people really want to get away from here. But that could take a while. Why? You'd better ask Lee about that. If you meet him, he's got plans. Tell me more about the mercenaries. Well, if you're as tough as you were back then, you shouldn't have any problems with them. Most of them are ruffians, and if you can't stand up to them, you won't get far. <laughs> if you're squeamish, you don't have a chance of joining them. How do I find the landowner's farm? It's quite simple. You leave the seaport by the east gate and then follow the path towards the east. I can take you there if you want. He never would have thought of that himself. That's a Okay, let's go. Where? Who says Don't things like that? To Onar's farm. Then let's go. Follow me. You have better show. I won't tell anything from now on. But so great was the wrath of Beliar that he came across the land and chose the beast. And Beliar spoke to it. He'd better shut up. Now that's typical, isn't it? No secret. If he doesn't see that, I can't help it. You seem to have bitten off more than you can chew. I'll get That's even with you. Along. You can count on it. I used to say that myself. That's not what I heard. So, 
Here we are. So, the rest of the way you can manage alone. I have to get back to the city. I've got a few things to take care of. Just follow this road here. And remember, stand up for yourself and don't take any crap, and it'll be smooth sailing. I think I've found something. Hey, you! That will never change. This here is your hut? Yes. Why? Anything wrong with it? Don't you have any problems with the mercenaries? Uh, as long as I don't interfere with their business, they'll leave me alone too. Moreover, they're good customers, and I pay them to keep an eye on my house when I'm not home. That's really not my problem. Show me how I can hit harder. If you want to learn more, you'll need to train hard. Nobody will learn anything from me. Well, Show me no your wares. Deal. There isn't much choice, I'm afraid. I'd have gone about it differently. That was no big deal. If he doesn't see that, I can't help him. He simply needs to practice more. He never would have thought of that himself. Can't rely on that. That's been known a long time. Nobody wants to know. Yeah, he really said that. I used to say that myself. Don't tell me you didn't know that. Been there, done that. Nobody will learn anything from me. His decision was it? It's a bad business. That will never change. <laughs> <laughs> 